is Barry from GuitarPCB.com and I'm going to show you how to wire up some pots. Basically what I do is I start out with a short piece of wire maybe two and a half inches long and strip just a bit off the end like so. Once I do that and I have enough to cover all the pots that I'm going to need I take this bit and I bend it back. Like so. Once I do that, I take my pot and my solder lug and I run this wire through so it catches in there and pull it back to the point and set it down on my work area. Pull it snug to the D, and I take the tip of my finger and I push down and around to kind of give it a good solid mechanical connection. Okay, once I do that, the wire kind of holds there on its own. I take my solder and my soldering iron and I go ahead and secure it with some solder to the lug. I'm going to go ahead and finish this up. And there we go. Once I have my wires, and obviously I measured one of them wrong, so I'm going to go ahead and even those out. What I like to do, but it's not necessary, is grab some heat shrink and cut off three pieces of the same size. Put them over. Push them down over the lug. Like so. You end up with something like that. Once you have that, then you can go ahead and use your torch or lighter whatever it is you're, you're using and apply a little heat to it without burning it both sides and you end up with something like that that's a finished one and of course once you finish all four you can go ahead and solder them into your circuit where they need to go and after you're finished that, what I like to do is add some of my pot condoms that I design, which protect the back of the circuit from hitting off the pot. They look like this. They're pre-made. You can get them off of my site. You put the either red or blue backing piece inside then take the whole thing place it over and press down onto the pot and they fit on there very snugly so as you can see you have a very nice protective potentiometer to go ahead and install into your enclosure. This way when the back of the circuit comes down and sits against it, you're not going to have any trouble with the copper side of the circuit 
shorting out against the back of the pot. Plus, I don't know, they just look cool. I hope that helps and thanks for watching.